Despite being the CEO of electric car company Tesla, Elon Musk is a big fan of traditional four wheels, especially if they can go fast or underwater. Looking at the car collection of avid car collectors or those who owns a lot of them is interesting. But then it is about one of the richest people on the planet who also owns a car company. Things get a little more gripping. So let's check out some of the rides which are owned by Elon Musk. Released in October 1908, the Ford Model T was Henry Ford's very first attempt to build and mass produce a car to offer to the public. The most influential car of the 20th century, the Model T was a gift to Musk from a friend, which makes sense as an influential car to an influential man. The Ford Model T was just $850 when it was released. Before Musk moved to Canada in 1988, he was 17 and fell in love for the very first time. No, this isn't about relationship, but it was the Jaguar E-Type Roadster. Musk said the one I like the most was the E-Type, and if I can afford it, that is the car I am going to get. And so he brought it. Musk launched his first company in 1995 called Zip2, a software business company. Some of the capitalist investors gave Musk a healthy forty thousand dollar, and he spent the most of that on the E-Type. A 1978 BMW 320i was Elon's very first car. It was the first version of BMW 3 Series that was unveiled in 1975 at Munich Olympic Stadium. With a fuel-injected 2-liter engine, the car could sprint from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 10 seconds and could top out at 112 mph. In 1994, Elon Musk brought a used 1978 BMW 320i for just $1,400. Back in 2013, a representative for Elon Musk entered a building to bid on an iconic piece of James Bond memorabilia, a modified 1976 Lotus Esprit. Created by a Florida company for $100,000, Musk spent almost $1 million for the Lotus. Musk said it was amazing as a little kid in South Africa to watch James Bond drive his Lotus, press a button, and have it transform into a submarine underwater. He was disappointed to learn that it can't actually transform. But Musk is going to upgrade it with a Tesla electric powertrain and try to transform it for real. The best car ever exists in Elon's opinion is the McLaren F1. When he first sold his company, he was faced with the decision of buying a house in Palo Alto or pulling the trigger on a McLaren F1. According to Musk, the decision was not difficult to take. With the funds he received from Zip2, he purchased the supercar, a rare car to behold. Only 106 McLaren F1s were ever made, with Musk buying the number 67, which was one of the seven imported to the United States in 1997. Given a top speed of 240 mph, Musk claimed he had hyped the car to 215 mph on a private runway. Musk would drive the McLaren F1 on his trips from LA to San Francisco. Musk didn't even bother with insurance, as he thought he would never be someone who damages a McLaren F1. But the impossible sometimes does happen, and Musk crashed the car after heading to an investment meeting with his friend Peter. At this point, the car only accumulated 11,000 miles. Nobody was injured except the McLaren. At this point of time, Musk was the founder of Xcom, a payment company that was merged with Confinity, which would become PayPal. The giant virtual auction site eBay brought Musk company back in 2002. which paid Musk 165 million dollars to certainly help repair the F1 Musk eventually sold the car in 2007 and made a profit BMW specialist turned the incredible M5 into something even greater with a 5 liter V10 engine under the hood Herman was able to top into the car and increase its horsepower rating to 603 while also increasing the speed from 150 mph to an insane 199 miles per hour the four seater car was so fast that it may have helped Musk as he launched the Tesla Model S with ludicrous mode back in 2008 Tesla unveiled the first electric car known as the Roadster utilizing lithium batteries the car had a range of 227 miles the Roadster was able to go from 0 to 60 miles per hour in a lightning speed of 3.7 seconds which was the same acceleration speed of a Lamborghini Gallardo the first person to own the Roadster was none other than Elon Musk who used the car as a daily driver for years When Elon Musk was married with his first wife Justin, he had quite a large family. After she gave birth to a twin in 2004 and a triplet back in 2006. At that point of time, Tesla was in the process of building a two-seater car 
but must needed something a bit bigger for his family. Must chase on Audi Q7, an SUV known for extreme luxury, although he wasn't super impressed with the substance of the vehicle. Elon Musk was asked which car he drives the most. The answer is his Tesla Model S. This four-door electric car sits up to five people and it can sprint from 0 to 100 in less than three seconds, all thanks to the ludicrous mode launch system called a game changer by the Top Gear magazine. Elon Musk has a strong love for Porsche 911, an iconic German car. The Porsche 911 is still one of the top cars to own for a car lover to this day. Elon Musk's one issue with the Porsche 911 was the engine's strong thrust fire gas. In 2003, Musk met up with the engineer JB Stravel to discuss ideas for future technology, and his ears perked at the thought of the cars that were powered strictly by batteries. Strabble had been working closely with Alan Kokeny, a man who successfully made a prestige electric car called the T0. Musk tried to buy it but Kokeny refused to sell the car. Musk asked if he could turn his 911 into an EV car. Put a lithium pack in my car, Musk begged Kokeny. I have a Porsche. If you can take the guts out of it and make it an electric car, I would be willing you to pay to a quarter million dollars, Musk said. Kokeny still resisted. but. He put Musk in the right direction by getting him in touch with a few people who had an e-company of their own. A company known now as Tesla, Musk paid $30 million to get involved and well, we all know how this turns out, still unsure about whether the Porsche was turned into an electric car or not. We are familiar with the Cybertruck recently launched by Tesla with its big blocky design that looks like it came straight from the future. Tesla's new FE truck sits 6 people and has a range of 500 miles and it is made of hard stainless steel and armed glass that doesn't break. Over 200,000 people already put down $100 deposits to secure their very own EV Cybertruck. While others may laugh at the truck, Tesla raised $20 million during the Cybertruck process. That concludes the list of Elon Musk car collection that ranges from normal vehicles to over the top and of course with a few Tesla vehicles sprinkled in the mix.